Oh, oh okay. wait. Let me flip up the, um... Are there snakes? Oh, it's filming. Welcome back to Beauty in the Yard. This week, rain comes to California, which is a huge blessing. However, because everything has been so dry, the rain causes tree branches to break. We clean up the yard, and I learn to drive the coyote tractor. We have another beautiful Saturday morning here, and I came out this morning to set up, and I noticed something that's gonna keep us busy this morning. We had a big limb fall last night right onto our well house. You gotta be careful cutting this out. What a pain. But you know what? The boys are gonna love it. They're gonna think this is the greatest thing in the world. Doesn't take much to please them. Let's go get the boys. Whoa, look! I broke up there. Oh this is awesome! How oh, yeah. I did not break the shed. That's what I'm asking. Wow. This must the shed right there a little bit. So Emmett, how are we going to get this limb down? The right way would to be use a chainsaw. Sorry. It's okay. How do you think we should get this limb down? The right way would to be use a chainsaw. The right way would be to... Ah. Well, the right way would to be use a chainsaw. The right way would to be... We should use a chainsaw, but I think it would be better to use the tractor. All right, let's get set up. We'll get it cleaned up. We got lucky. This limb fell and didn't hit any of our trees. We have three Japanese maples and this new wisteria tree that we planted just about a year ago. And uh, it fell kind of in between everything. And luckily the well house broke the fall. All right, we have to remove this. And we want to be very careful because I'm concerned if we try to cut it down, it may fall and roll and damage something. So I think we're going to take Turner's advice. We're going to use a tractor, chain it up, see if we can't hoist it slightly and maybe slowly walk it back i don't think anything can go wrong with that got the boys here to help me anyway that's what we're gonna try wish us luck daddy mm -hmm. once we finish this can we go back to sleep mm -hmm. not today I mean, dude, we're gonna ride motorcycles. I'm gonna today, beat my friends in my fleet. I thought today was supposed to be a soccer game for Miles and me. It is. And a Saturday, which means sleeping in. Don't you say it, I can't hear it I get defensive when I think you're calling me out But I don't scream, I don't shout I seethe in my anger, I swallow my answers I try to
What do you got there, Turner? Big fork and right. Okay, bring it over. Hustle, muscle. You want me to grab that guy and limit the top on it? Hmm. What are we doing? I don't know. Are they dull? Huh? Are they dull? Yeah, that's okay. Sure. Take that. But if you're telling me that you found me out. That's how it's done. I hate to be the one. After this, can we go up with it? I'll back up some. Oh, I'm lowering. Lowering. Okay, flip it back. Flip it back. Yeah, okay, that's it. Hey, boys, come here. Oh, we're going in. Hold on. Oh, wow. Okay, go grab the other end so we can carry it out. What's up? Turn it. Trying to get back there. All the way to the back. All the way to the back. Climb over it. Well, here's the back. Yeah. Okay. And then, boys, come behind us and pick up all the little stuff. So, okay, Mazda's out. Just go high, Turner. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh, Sorry, I thought you were turning. Maybe because it's. Well, I mean, I think it's because I'm, I'm just so okay. handsome that you just always want to say my name. Wait, were you calling him an animal? That's how it's done. And now it was on the way to end when I threw it, it hit my hand. Well, you gotta be careful. Yeah, nails. What? Nails. I don't want to talk about nails. Why? I cut my toe up and got three stitches on a nail. What? People want to know. What happened? I was on my porch running to my um, grandpa and so, um, when it was summer. Um, and I was barefoot on our porch, and this little nail um, was sticking up out of our porch a little bit, and my toe caught it, and it cut my toe back really deep, and I had to get three stitches. Stuart just sliced his foot open. We are going to urgent care. Baby, it's gonna be okay, all right? I don't want to go to the store anymore. I just okay, want to okay. go home. What do you say to the doctor? Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, sweetheart, you're good. Oh, there they are. Oh. Can I see? Can I see? Can I see? Yes, I'll show you. I'll show you. Shake my hand. You did great, buddy. Listen to me. Look at me. I, would, I think I would have screamed more. You know that, all right? It's intense, too. Look at all these doctors who are helping you. You know, so Amazing. sweet, baby. Wow, are you okay now? Yeah, my dad said it was the most blood he's ever seen. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Okay, Bob. So these limbs have been falling, obviously, and Jason came in to get me because another one just fell. So we're going to clean it up together. She's going to do it. This is a better one, I think. I don't think I'd get the tractor for this one. So it fell from up there. Yeah. It Wait, did. Are there snakes? There could be. That's part of it, babe. Move that branch out of the way. Feel safe. Uh-huh. Try lifting it. See if you can get it out of here. Watch out for scorpions and spiders. What was wrong? All right, you can use the tractor. Okay. So we're gonna move the limb so it's more perpendicular with the level part of the grass. It'll be easier for Kim to use the tractor and hoist this thing up. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's boys, go. maybe the boys can do it and I'll just get in the tractor. Oh, Huh? Maybe the boys can move it and I'll just get in the tractor. No, let's see. Here, we're gonna... Let's go with this. Here, ah. over here. 
Go straight, watch out. I'm strong! It's okay, hold on. Move, 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 move. I'm strong! How much stronger is the football club? Okay, that's good. Okay, Kim, so it's all you, babe. Okay. Let's get this thing out of here. Okay, I don't know how to turn on the tractor. Is or it just like a, is it like a car? Oh, brother. Well, yeah, I'll do it. If it's like a car, then I can do it. I mean, I'm just saying, That's I don't right, know. I felt like the lawnmower was hard. Yeah, we're going to let your nine-year-old teach you how to do it. Okay. Okay, Mom. Get on. All right. So I'm going to get on. And you can just oh. see by the... Uh, I think it's okay. Be. All right. So then put your... Um, wait, is it in neutral over there? Uh, no, it's an M. Okay. Just put it into neutral. Okay. Okay. Wait, now, there's two neutral. Yeah, it's okay. They're both the same thing. Oh. Okay, now put your foot on that pedal. What is that pedal, Miles? It's... It's a clutch. The clutch, yeah. Oh, this has a clutch? Not that kind of clutch. Okay. Then pull. Um, push. Turn it yep. on. Okay. Um, now, get that up. Oh, okay. yeah. Miles, how far? Just how many RPMs? Between, between right here and here. So on the on the yellow line. Between 18 and 20, that's 1800 and 2000. And lifting this up. Yeah. Slowly. Okay. Okay, so look. You see this? Just move it back. No, Bob. Tell them they're slipping the bucket. Right, so, you know, hold on, wait, wait. So look, you go to the right, left pivot down, you go to the left and pivot up, and then of course, forward is down, back is up, and you have to go really slow to try to keep it broken. Okay? So we want to, you don't want to keep it too high when you're driving, you want to keep it level as you can, and I would say a couple of feet off the ground, it's safer that way. Now I push it into the can. See how it comes out? Now it's released. Yeah, this is called a hydro stack. Which means you don't have to shift forward and backward. Forward and backward. So you hit this one. And then you have to slow to get a point. Woo! I'm down the chest there! I got no money. Like it or not, I'm funny Still in search of my destination I like to party Living my way is arty All I offer is my reputation Oh, there's no standing Very unsafe Yeah, that's right Hey, hold on Hey, why well, you have a spotter Everyone has one that's why you have someone helping you, a spotter. Not everybody does. You need to, with your force like this, you gotta get them love it. I never seen that. If you haven't done that yet, you're trying to go forward. That's why I have to be able to see it. I don't know which way this This is a demonstration of how not to drive a tractor. Hey, let's walk this way. This party will rock every minute stolen. If you want to be my midnight mover, you blow my mind. And it would be kind of a groovy story if you want to be my midnight mover. Okay, well, that was fun. So Kim is following us now with her limb. She will never stop talking about how awesome she did, and she did do a pretty good job. However, there was a few things that she should have done different, like maybe practice for one minute before she tried. 
but that's okay. She got it up and it looks great. Now we're gonna go dump it and then we're gonna go back with the other bucket and pick up all the loose scraps. But uh, yeah, Kim is ready now to do tutorials on tractor driving, especially using a set of forks. Look how good she's doing. Oh, my boys are really good too. Here's our master operator. And then, oh, we got a master operators everywhere. Wait, Stuart, why are you standing up? Oh, he's the flag boy. I don't know why we keep having these limbs fall. It's yeah. been so dry and so hot here. I think that when it does rain, and it rained two nights ago, and it was a surprise rain. It is the first time in, I don't know, months that we've had any kind of moisture at all in the air. And I was, I went to bed at like, it was like 9.15, and I heard something outside. It sounded like somebody rolling something on our driveway, like our, our trash cans, or it was a weird sound. It was thunder. <gasps> oh, that was cool. It's like I can never get it. Well, I smell the ozone. <laughs> I never know where it's going to be. Maybe you have to look out our window. Oh, there rain! 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 That's how separated I am from thunder. It's been so long. And anyway, then we had an incredible lightning storm that night and it rained on and off all night long. Awesome. But I think that uh, really helps some of these trees absorb water. We had two limbs fall and uh, luckily we didn't have any big trees or, or major stuff happen. But we'll spend a little bit of time cleaning up real quick and we'll be all good. Next week, Kim will be teaching an advanced course on tractor operation. Apparently, I wasn't supposed to just turn it off. That's okay. We're good. Kim did an amazing job. We got the big limb out of the way. Now we're going to go find the boys and have them load all the little stuff into the bucket. Kim, can you take the tractor back over there? I'm sure I can, but you know, I don't think that you really um, gave me much credit for understanding the weight of the limb and going far to the left of it so that I could make sure that it was balanced once I scooped it up. That was amazing. I mean, I don't yeah, think most people could that do good. that on their first try. I think that I understood the situation. Yeah, no, you, you understood it perfectly. What else did you do that was great? I drove across the bridge. No, she did a good job driving across the bridge. And I got it out mm -hmm. of it, out of the forks. She did. She dumped it off the forks just right. She I don't did. know how I could have done any better besides not just turning it off. Kim did perfect. No, I think you did a great job. Okay, you did such a good job. We'll give more jobs for you to do. So right now, take it back over there, and you then you can then you can then remove the forks, and you can uh, add the big bucket to the oh. tractor. Okay, we'll be over there waiting. That'll be kind of hard because I don't I can't see the front. We're gonna be waiting to learn something new today. Okay, we'll see you over there, babe. Let's see if she gets it started or not. Hey boys, come pick me up. I take back everything I just said. She just started it on her own. All right, what do you think about mom? She's doing good. She's yeah, doing good. good for the first time. Yeah, she did great. Daddy, Let's get over there. Daddy, I'm yeah, are you sitting down? We're going. Back to the same area.
Hey babe, go dump it. Huh? Go dump it. Hey, give it more power. But still so strong, but I like it, like, like it, like that. Hey, how do you feel about mom taking over your tractor duties? Mm, I don't know, it lets me rest, but I like the tractor a little more. Yeah, okay. The name is Tarzan. Now we catch your fire. Today was a productive Saturday. Who knew I was gonna learn how to drive a tractor because limbs fell in the yard? Yep, got all the limbs cleaned up. We didn't have any major damage, so we're happy about that. And it was, yeah, that was amazing actually that that one big limb that fell on the well house fell perfectly on the well house and didn't disrupt any of the new trees around it. You don't understand, we love our Japanese maples here. We probably have 30 around the yard. Or and more. Or more, and so we do everything we can to protect them, but it's hard to protect them from falling limbs that happen in the middle of the night. And one of the reasons the limb probably fell was because we were super lucky the other night. You guys know that we live in Northern California. We've been dealing with all these crazy fires. I mean, every year is fires, every year is drought, and we never get summer rains. And the other night we got this crazy, amazing thunderstorm. It was like being in the South, right? It was a show, it was great. Yeah, lightning, thunder. We believe that that long rain that night probably swelled into our trees that were super dry and probably created too much weight. And that's the reason we got a lot of snapping limbs that night. 
It's okay because it took on some dead wood. Those limbs were already, looked like they were already struggling. So they're down, cleaned it up a little bit, and uh, we got lucky. We're good. And Kim did a great job driving the tractor, cleaning all that up. What can I say? I'm <laughs> a pro. We're going to put a bit more work now. <laughs> Perfect. You guys, thanks for joining us on today's adventure in the yard. You guys are the best, and we will see you on the next video. Bye. 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 Join us next week as we dig holes in the hardest soil you've ever seen. It's clay and it's rock and it's tons of granite so that we can plant oleander at the edge of our property line.